need to see, you know, the decisions that has been made earlier has to be implemented. Uh, in the first place, uh, like uh, the loss and damage, uh, which has been uh, decided in COP27, is the most important instrument that Africa can benefit because we are the you know the least emitters of greenhouse gas um, uh, to the atmosphere, but we are the most affected continent, and uh, most of our people are smallholder farmers and they are very much affected. But this is very important that we get this uh, loss and damage uh, compensation. Uh, and uh, second. We want to see Africa uh, gets uh, more funding for the adaptation process. You know, there are erratic rains, flooding, droughts, and storms and heavy uh, landslides that are affecting very much uh, the African continent. So we see this uh, very essential to adapt to these uh, climate situations. And in adaptation, we need, uh, especially for the, our agriculture, and uh, renewable energy resources are uh, very important. I expect from COP28, putting agriculture and food system at the center uh, of the climate discussions, which has never been the case earlier. And also uh, nature-based solutions uh, are very important. So the, the Kuiming Biodiversity uh, you know, Convention, which has been decided uh, last year, has to be implemented as part and parcel of the climate change agenda. So I think these all are important expectations I want from this COP to happen.